players be holding up that standard of play before you see a drop off. And um, you just hope that they kind of reach the mountaintop before they get there. Cause it'd be really disappointing if this team that we believe to be so great, you know, currently they wouldn't even be remembered as the same as the bills. Cause the bills at least got to the Super Bowl every single time uh, for people who don't know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the bills that they, they never won the Super Bowl, but they went, I think five years in a row. Right. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I, I feel like this, like they're running out of patience almost. Uh, and you're right. Like, you aren't going to be as dominant as you were the previous year. Like the idea that you're just going to go out and be able to do it again every year is like, that's just wishful thinking. And that's why everyone talks about a window because windows like the window to get in the championship in any sport is real. Like there's only so many times that you can try it with the same group of guys before like the fire is going to burn out. Right. So that's what you're hoping that like with this team, it, we hope that we're not seeing like the fire burn out. I, I don't think that's the case really yet. Um, just because of how they looked at the beginning of the season. Like there's no yeah. way if the fire burned like, out, it I don't think exists. it'd be, yeah, it wouldn't be in the middle of the season. I don't think. Yeah. Right. So I, I still have hope. And Randy pointed out, you know, Kyle's record in October is 11 of 19 or 1119. Uh so that's that's not great. I don't know what that's about, right? <laughs> that seems like a that's a trend. That's a trend at that, that point, is. not a great one. Uh but this team at, at the second half of the season has always I think been I know what it is. Drake energy. always puts out I think I know what it is. Drake always puts out an album in October. So Kyle <laughs> Shanahan's jamming. And there's lots of candy. And you know what? That, that affects your blood sugar. It makes you, like, kind of panicked. You get a little excited at the wrong times. You're not sleeping Much very sugar. well. You're, yeah. you're eating those, you know, the Snickers and the caramel. And you're, like, doing that. And you're supposed to be sleeping. But they have to stay up because they're game planning. So they're like, okay, well, what about a Reese's? And then they're arguing over Reese's. And now all of a sudden the position coaches are like, well, I want the Skittles. And there's only one packet of Skittles. And you know what I mean? You, and now you're wasting You've definitely time. thought of this before, I think. So, you know, <laughs> I honestly, I have empathy now that we put it that way for Kyle. And maybe you know we should what? boycott the month of October and just skip straight to November where everyone is thankful. <sighs> yeah, seriously. I mean, no, really. Like, hopefully Sunday because it's it's now November, right? Hopefully yeah, Sunday is when the they can... Oh yeah, like right. That. Like hopefully. I want to do that too. I want to get rid of October. My October. It's it's a new. And it doesn't. You know, it's like it January, make... new me, new New Year, new me. That's Kyle Shadyhead, but with November. New month. He's like, all mm-hmm. right, I put you through it. You know, I just had to tease you. I had to make you a little excited. They need a. Um, right. You don't want to. They need a no loss November. I don't know what's happening no in October. Oh, I like that. I no like that. No loss November. What is it? No shave November, or is that no shave October? For the yeah, for the beards, no, no. right? Yeah, yeah, I know. Not, <laughs> <laughs> I like, I'm not talking about that. Uh, yep, this guy said uh, it's a it's a trend for Kyle as well. Um, hopefully that that trend can can stop though, because I I agree that I don't think it's it's hard because the fan in me is like, okay, we've been here before, we can do it again. But then when I hear other people say that, I'm like, well, you can't count on that. Like yeah. you, well, you have to look at you have the to, players. You have the players themselves say that, which is concerning to me. It's like, you can't keep thinking you can do this. Like, it's just yeah. so, it's so weird. Like they just keep hanging their hat on. Well, both no. Debo and Fred Warner in their, on their podcast. I, I find it so interesting that players have podcasts nowadays. I'm, totally here for it but it's it is interesting to kind of get a little bit of a insight into maybe how they're thinking I really love the one with Fred Warner because he tries to still be very like leader and like kind of not PR because he does try to you know be casual is that the right term he he tries to be fluid but you can tell that there's like a bit of like a you know I'm not airing out my you know the team's dirty laundry on here but then his wife who I love is like very fan so she'll be like she was like going in on moody she was like I love I love that she she knows like every like she she does she she she, before the Bengals game she was like Joe Burrow's good she like low-key was like yeah I thought that they were gonna beat Kirk Cousins because like doesn't Kirk Cousins suck and he was like he was like kicking her, like don't, say like like if you say that, they're gonna think that he's like this is gonna go viral. <laughs> Stop. Um, um, no, but, but like, what I was gonna say about yeah, that is both of them, Debo and Fred Warner, on their podcast, both alluded to that, like oh we've been here before, 
sentiment. So like, we're not worried. And it's like, okay, well, can you look at that as like luck instead of just like the standard yeah. that you just like happen to have to suck? Because like I said, even if they bounce back, it worries me. Like this turn is concerning for me, not because I'm, you know, down in the dumps about the rest of the season, but because I think it affects their ability to win the Super Bowl, especially when you look at a team like yeah. the Eagles, you know. The, it, like, and that's okay. ultimately it, the ultimately the goal. The goal isn't can we come back out of this slump and like win some exactly. playoff games. So the goal is can we win a Super Bowl? Yeah. And and if you're trying to get a Super Bowl, your goal in season should be getting that number one seed because it's now two years in a row that they've like screwed the pooch to be able to get the the one seed. And <sighs> look, let's just say they figure it out. They have a strong second half of the season. They get to the playoffs. They're not going to get that one seed. You're you're heading into Philadelphia in in the winter or whatever and having to play a playoff game like you just shot yourself in the foot. And, and you're seeing the results of it months later. Yeah, you went on this, like, nice run and everything. But the the consequences of these last three games are going to show up in, in the playoffs. And I don't – I feel like that's not – That's, like, they keep, something they They're, like, get. brushing yeah. it off. Is like, well, yeah, like, we'll be fine. We'll make it to the playoffs. Yeah, but, you know, when you're yeah. – when you have to play in Philadelphia, uh, you know, in, in the playoffs, if you get that far – you're you're in trouble. That's not a situation you want to be in. So again, like yeah. they're digging themselves into a hole. And this and this is like when we're talking about they they've came out and they've you know said oh it's like we've played a whole extra season all this it's like okay well get the first seed then that way you can have an extra rest because uh, exactly. in the player interviews That's... in the player interviews that I watched today all of them talked about how necessary this bye week was and this rest and it's like okay really and they were like oh you know this is re really going to refresh us to turn our our season around for the rest of the season. And it's like, that's great for the rest of the season. I wish you were in a position to also get that before the Super Bowl, because are you going to feel like you're all talking about how burnt out you were by this time? You're going to have to do this again and then somehow have an extra 